guys welcome to another video with mel today we are visiting the official nintendo dream address so the official nintendo island um this code was unveiled with the thanksgiving update um so anybody can visit this one i'll put the code the dream address down in uh the information for the video so if you want to come here as well you can do it uh this is my first time visiting it i'm gonna have a look around see how nintendo has made their island I do expect it to be a bit more plain than other people's islands. I have had lots of like um, custom content and like tried to use different materials to make different settings, but we're gonna have a look anyway. So uh, we're, we're with Luna now. We've just dreamt and we're arrived at Ninten, which is the official name of the island. So let's go have a look around. Hey, you are deep slumber, dream peacefully the island of Ninten. When you wish to awaken from this dream, you need only to lie down on the bed and I will take care of the rest. Also, should you have any questions or need any advice about dreams, please do not hesitate to ask. Okay, so let's have a look at Ninten. So first things first, we are in the town square. We can see the flag has a picture of Mr. Nook on it. Hello, Tommy Tommy. Can I go inside? Oh, of course, you can't go inside resident services. It's very silly that. Um, we've got our custom content board. Let's have a look at this, see what content might be able to take home with us. Let's see. Let's see what we got. Oh, so we just got the Nook flag. <laughs> and we've got a shirt with Nook on it as well. Okay, not the most interesting thing. Pretty much the same design, but one for a shirt, one for a flag. So, okay. Um, the person that made it is called uh, Nina. Okay. I'm guessing that's the name of the villager here. I wonder how this works then, Nintendo, if they have just like one person make an official island and they probably use this for all the commercials. Hello! Hi! Hi, Puddles! I could be one of your fans if you wanted me to be. I always feel like Puddles is wearing like a ski mask with her eyes poking out. I've never actually met her um, outside of like villager hunting. Ah! Splish. Dream and you're meeting me, so you have to. Okay, so we've got puddles. What other villagers do we have? Actually, let's not spoil the surprise. We're going to walk around to find them. Okay, we've got little mushroom little seats here. I don't have hardly any of the mushroom content yet. I need to get more. I like how they've put the fences around their flowers. It looks very nice. Oh, um, I need to get more of the mushroom content. I've only got very few things, although Isabel announced today that I should be looking for mushrooms. Oh, we've got a car bed, so we're pretending this is an actual car. Have a little... <laughs> it beeps when you sit. No, I didn't know that. Oh my god, that's so funny. <laughs> uh, we've got like the little service station sign and a little car and a little mushroom, which I guess is supposed to look like a little lamp post. Oh, we found someone else. <gasps> Poncho. I thought it was Blue Bear at first. Poncho. I don't think I've ever met Poncho. Doing a little badminton around here before. Never too late to start. Welcome to the island, little bear. I wonder if they change their villagers regularly. Like if you came back in like six months, if it'd be a different one. Oh, hello. Is that Rhonda? Hello, Rhonda. The only rhino I've ever had is Meringue. So I've never had Rhonda. A pleasure to see you again, though. We haven't met before, have we? Oh, Bigfoot. <laughs> what a weird thing to say. Sorry, I woke up with the most marvelous dream, and I'm still getting my bearings. Amazing. She has a lot of paint on her face. Ah, will it be closed today? Yes, because we're in a dream. We can't go shopping dreams, of course. <laughs> I'd be very careful. It seems to be around. Oh. And we've got more little car stuff back here and another balloon. Okay. We've got a pile of leaves. I love the leaves. I love the noise they make. One of the best noises in the whole game. 
We got our museum. I'm guessing it has everything in it. Does it have all the paintings? Let's go see if it has all the paintings because like it's so hard to get the paintings guys. I want to see the paintings because I never not don't have that whole section yet. I think most people do. I think most people have the fossils and that's it. So let's go look at the painting area. I'm very kind of curious to see what it looks like. I think I've got maybe four or five paintings. Oh, even their museum is not complete. Ha ha, funny that. The official Nintendo museum is incomplete. Formative statue, the Rosetta Stone. Amazing. Okay, so even their museum is not fully done. <laughs> Which is ridiculous, guys. Okay, the same one. That's uh, boyfriend sneezing in the background, guys. Sorry. He's a very loud sneezer. What's this? Oh, uh, the quaint painting. Okay, we got that. Oh, we've got one, two, three, four items so far, which is about the same as I have. The warm painting. I don't have this one either. Okay, so so far they have four paintings, which is the same amount I do. Ooh, oh, we got some more paintings this way. Five common painting. Okay. I would have thought they would have the section done. Six. Nice painting. I've got six paintings. Oh, oh, got the nice one. Let me click on that. Right here. Tom painting. I like the dot painting. Okay. Was that? That was seven, wasn't it? Seven, eight. I have this one. Eight. So, do they just have eight paintings? Looks like it. Oh, there's something here as well. They have dynamic painting. Why is that one so small? It's the wave. We have that one in our house, actually. Uh, got like a copy of that. So they have nine paintings. So they have twice as many paintings as me. But I thought this section would be completely full. I'm very kind of disappointed that it isn't. I was hoping to walk through the whole art gallery, but I guess they don't want to spoil too much for us. All right. Bye, Blathers. You're the only NPC I can talk to, <laughs> apparently. Okay, so we're back out here. I like what they've done with the amber. That looks nice. And I like the little fossils behind. They seem to have apples as their... Can I knock them down? I go again. Cool. Uh, we got mushroom. I can pick a mushroom. I can't take it back with me, but pick it. Little piano. A little bit of electronica. <laughs> And we can't play this one. Wrong position. What? Oh, I go behind it. Amazing. Beautiful. Okay, let's go this way. Oh, there's a stick on the ground. What is this about? Oh, no, that's a mushroom. Sorry, I thought it was a stick. I'm like, not even keeping their island nice looking. Okay. Got a little park thing here with a vending machine. This looks very kind of Japanese because of the vending machine. And they have blue and yellow chairs. I've got the pink and like the teal. Someone's house is down here. Near the beach. You can see in their beach. They've really reduced down the land. There's not a lot of hills. I'm guessing all their hills are somewhere else. Oh, it's a uh, Velma. I kind of like Velma. Just because she's very unique to have a female. I, she reminds me of Velma from Scooby-Doo. A female with a beard. Oh, well, my dear, it's a pleasure to meet you in such a dreamy place. Ah, oh, that's fine. Thank you, Velma. Got a cooler over here. Got sea life, and we can look out at Harv's Island in the distance. How you doing today, Harv? Okay, let's go back down and look at the house. We'll go way back down. Oh, I didn't mean to click on her gun. Aw. Thanks for talking to me, even though it's a dream. That's nice of her. Lovely Velma. So far, you're my favorite villager here. Oh, is that a fossil? A fossil. Oh, maybe it was just another mushroom. There's a lot of mushrooms around. Do, 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 do. I like their paving. 
There's no custom pass here, guys. Oh, we've got like a little round custom pass. That's quite cool. Whose house is this? Uh, this is Puddle's house. Well, I've never seen this before. What does that do? Oh, it's like the, um, the bamboo one. The bamboo baby thing. That's cute. I don't have that. Go check the beach here as well. Oh, we have a harp. I don't think I've ever seen a harp. I'm guessing it's one of the Zodiac items. I don't... I'm missing, like, one of them, I think. Run in. I'm so glad you can't wreck grass in the game. Oh, they have a teddy bear picnic. But they're playing, um... Oh, they're playing bad badminton. Ah, uh, what is it called? Ping pong. We got two twins and another bear. He's watching, spectating. I, I like their fence around it. It's a very nice fence. I like how they've made a little garden for them as well. Let's go back up to the place. Do, 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 do. Oh, we got our able sisters, which we can't go in. A little, like, Oh, in the thing. Oh, we've got a, there's a fossil over here. Can we open, get this fossil? Can we get to our tools? Oh, yeah. I, no, we can't get our tools. I can't get the fossil, guys! I want the fossil. I want to, oh, okay, I like this little cardboard triceratops here. That's really cool. Very loud waterfall, though. Go up. Oh, different fencing. A bit severe. I don't want anybody up here. Oh. Oh, hello! Hi! Are you Nina? Hi, Nina! Do you not say anything except for welcome? You're a bit boring. You, you seem to have knocked down a wasp's nest. You should be careful. Nina's a bit boring. I'm gonna wreck her flowers! <laughs> it's alright, guys. They'll grow back very quickly. Or they won't need to because it's a dream. <laughs> Oh my god, look at those mushrooms. I've never seen that one. That's ginormous. That must be a furniture item. Hi, Rhonda. Look at all the different uh, materials on the ground here. Other wasp nests. They seem to have a problem with wasps. Can I take home items? So, like, if I pick up, like, this, can I take it home with me? I'm wondering if that's why they're on the ground. Can we take them home with us? Take the pine cone home? I have very few pine cones, so that would be quite useful if I could. A little bit of wood. Put them in our pocket. We can take them home with us. We will. I don't think you can take home anything from a dream. People would just like be leaving like rare items everywhere and be like, yes, take them home for my dream. Oh, I like how the well is back here. That's quite nice. A little bit of weeds on the ground. Ah, it's a money tree! Give me all the monies. Give me all the monies. Oh. Apparently, I want the weeds as well. Oh, it doesn't show my other money. I have like another 100,000 bells in my pocket. Oh, I like their little secret beach. I like that it's kind of set back here. Mine isn't as well hidden. I wish they were doing something with it, though. It doesn't seem very kind of... Hold on. Oh, we've got some tools. Oh, we can borrow some tools. Ah, so we could dig up the stuff. Is there a shovel? Ah, oh, here it is. Can I pick them up? I don't think I can pick them up. Well, that's just tempting me, and I can't even touch them. That's rude. <laughs> Give me the tools! <laughs> I guess it's the tools they use when they're doing stuff on the island. Oh, this one's purple. Cool. Okay, so we've got a bunch of fencing down here. Take this other pine cone. Mushy. I cannot look at a mushroom without calling it a mushy, guys. I know. I'm a product of the 80s. Not help that. Ooh. Another mushy. I don't think I can take any of these home with me, but I'm going to pick them up anyway. Wow, look at all the materials on the ground. Their island radio is going to go down. Isabel is going to complain to them. Okay, we have a caution thing here. I'm guessing they want us to be careful. Ah, oh, there's a little fire! Okay, let's go back over this bridge. I do like these bridges. I've got the really simple bridges. They were the cheapest ones. Oh, we got a peach tree. It's over here. Oh, it's like a school, I think. This is meant to be a school sometime, maybe? 
Uh, Velma's house, right? So Velma's got school-related stuff out of it. Maybe they think she likes studying? Possibly. Okay. Going back down again? Oh, there's a playground here. Cute. So they definitely have blue stuff. Sandbox, the slide, and wing. Oh. <laughs> Okay, this is their campground, it looks like. Oh, I like that they made a natural campground. That's really nice. Wow, look at this. Turn everything on. Got a bit of soup here. This is very nice. Very, very cool. Oh, look at all their fishies. Hello, it's like a little aquarium. Cute. I like how they've used this wood, and it's a different color as well, because usually it's just that... Kind of natural wood you always see this is nice big roaring fire okay Where we go all this way is there another path over here I'm guessing there is oh is this their house or is whose house is this oh someone's home let's have a look or it might be their house actually nope uh leopold i believe yes Ah, uh, since I dream, nothing we do matters, right? I could even sing dance hole and pull it off. If you want. Look at it, it's a Mr. Skeleton! Hello, Mr. Skeleton. Do your exercise. Did you guys know he could do that? He's awesome, because you can make him, like, creep. Yeah. Uh, do, 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 do. You can make him creepy. Creep? I'm going to leave him like that, scare Leopold. No, keep your arms up. Keep them up. No! <laughs> oh, he's good fun. Kind of our haunting uh, motion that we had. Let's haunt Leopold. Okay. We've seen Leopold. This is the top bit. Interesting use of layering, guys. Ooh, he's got like little science hickeys here. It's clearly a scientist. Bit of paper, pen to do some writing with. Oh, oh my God! Is this a jail? <gasps> Help! I'm in Nintendo jail. I'm in trouble. Putting copyrighted material on my flag. <laughs> oh, maybe they don't like this village, or maybe that's why they're in jail. <laughs> Who's this? Oh, it's Sterling. Okay, that makes more sense. Sterling, it's aesthetic. It's got, like, bars and stuff. I don't think I've ever met Sterling. I know of Sterling, of course. It's gonna be such a weird villager, but I've never met him. Uh, villager dreams to ground. You ever worry about having all these bars, dude? I'm just gonna put out your candles, because I can. <laughs> you have a bunk bed. That's more than you get in The Sims, even though it's not functional. <laughs> Okay, let's come out. Um, so that's Sterling. That explains why these suits of armor are outside. That makes a lot of sense now. Got kind of a nice view here. Cool. Oh, I like that they have the white uh, lamppost. I want the white lamppost. I don't have the white lamppost. Okay, so Nintendo Jail! You could take a really good picture with your friends if you were able to bring everybody there at the same time. So unfortunately, you can't. You have been put in jail. <laughs> Our little fishies. There's another fossil I can't get to. Can I get down this way? I think I have to go around. I get down. Okay. This way. A little lost here. I know I could look at the map, guys, but I don't want spoilers, so I'm just kind of wondering. We've seen most of the island now. Oh, it's a duck! Quack, quack! Quack, quack! <laughs> Hello. For some reason, I thought that shadow was like a giant fish. I'm like, why do they have giant fish? <gasps> Hello, Punchy! Oh, you sleepy punchy. I nearly had you on my island, punchy. You came to visit me, and then we decided not to have you. Mm. 
I miss you, Punchy, and your big eyelids. You're always so tired. That. They've got lots of bridges. Good use of bridges. I'm kind of interested to kind of go to you guys' islands as well. So if you did want me to visit your island, have a look. Oh, these loot. I think you can catch some of these leaves, possibly. If you did want me to visit your islands, let me know what your dream address is. And I'm happy to kind of come and have a look. Um, maybe film them as well. See? Maybe we could do a little series on visiting people's islands. That would be quite fun. I'm currently working on a bit of a goosebump project at the moment. Hope I can find the energy and the time to do it this week so you guys can get that video for next week. What? What was on there? What is that? Oh, it's a watering can. I'm like, what is that on top of there? It looked very lumpy. I'm like, what is it? I think we've nearly completed the full. Oh, I got a little magic wand. Hello. Look in our telescope. Anything good? Okay. Are we supposed to be catching leaves? Is that something that's been happening in the game? Because I don't remember seeing any leaves floating around like those. But they definitely kind of remind me of the Sakura Blossoms and also the, um... Hello again! Aww. Go, go for BR, okay. Um, they remind me of the Sakura Blossoms and the previous snowflakes. Oh! Let's play! Can we win? Can we win? No! Boo! Okay, I think this is the last part of the island, so we've got some residential homes over here. So, I think we go down to get to those. we got our beach. So most of their resident homes. Oh, what is this? I don't think I've ever seen this before. Is this a lamp? That's cool. Is this part of the mermaid set? I don't think I've ever seen that before. Okay, so a little. Oh, I'm guessing this is the village. This is your uh, player's house. Let's have a look. Okay, they seem to like seafood stuff. Oh, sorry, excuse me, guys. Very big one. Okay. Oh, uh, it seems to be a gym. The bed. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Got some protein powder. I feel like Goose should live here. Goose is my kind of working out villager. Do some ring fit adventure, guys. One, two, three, four, five. Yay, we win. Wish you could ride the treadmill. Rather than just turn it on. Getting all the exercise in. Oh, and we'll do a press up. Oh, you should put a light switch above this so you actually like, kind of jump up to it. Oh, there's more. There's another room. I have a gym when you walk in. Oh, no, that is it. Oh, that's a very small house. Okay. Uh, that was puddles. I do like this. I had this in the previous game. Okay, anybody in the house? Is there home, are they? Oh, there they are. Okay. Oh, it's Phoebe. I used to have Phoebe. Hey, Phoebe. Phoebe was one of my starter villagers along with Goose. She moved out a while ago. Ah, uh, I kind of do want to take a nap. I am very, very tired, Phoebe. Like I've got the, I'll just have to do, um, just take a, can I have the tired emote, please? Where is the tired emote? There is, and I can even see it on here. Ah, oh, there we go. I'm so sleepy. Okay, I'll be going. I borrowed your sleeping bag. You do not require a bed, apparently. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm. I don't think this person's in. Whose house is this? This is Poncho's house. He's got a punching bag, basketball hoop. Okay, so I think this is the full island. I'm pretty sure we've seen everything except for this corner over here. What is this? Oh, is this oh, there's like marshmallows. I don't think I've ever seen this fire. That's cute. The villagers' house. They have a golden phone booth, which I just want the blue one so I can make it a TARDIS. 
I got, I love this flower cart. My favorite items. And if we go up, we've got, looks like one last villager house. Oh, they have the ice cream light! Oh, I had this in the previous game. I haven't found it yet. I want the ice cream light so badly. And they got a peach. Ooh, ten peaches. Thank you. Ten whole peaches. Ten ball. This is Punchy's house. I like Punchy's house. It's back here. Oh, did we miss something? Did we go over there already? I don't feel like we've been over there. Go check that area. I don't know what's over there. I don't think we have been over there. If we did, I completely forgot about it. Get around with the bug. Go have a quick look. And then I think we'll go back to our island and the tour. Pretty easy to get around here. It is a lot more plain than islands I've seen. Um, I do like these balloons everywhere. Oh, yes, we did go this way. I think we just didn't do this area here. We've got another one of these, like, giant peach things. Amazing. That's the biggest peach ever. And we got little flowers here. Oh, yeah, we did come over here because I didn't know what that lump thing was. Yeah, so this is the official Nintendo Island. I mean, it looks like a standard Animal Crossing Island, like, before New Horizon. Oh, sorry, guys, keep going. I feel be this late. Um, it looks like a standard island before New Horizon. Um, kind of like what you would have probably done in, like, City Folk. Or... Hmm... Um, New Leaf, but of course you couldn't put so many items on the ground in New Leaf, but it has that kind of feel to it that's kind of more plain. Um, there's not a lot of like really interesting use of things. It's mostly just flowers and bushes and trees. Like this is a path with just trees on it. It's not that most, the most interesting thing in the world, but it, it does the job. It still looks pretty cool. It's got a bit of cotton candy for the road. Um, so yeah, it's, it's a good enough island. I think, I, there are so many creative ways to make your island, and I think they just don't want to overshadow people's imaginations and have the island be too much. And plus, this is probably, like, the island, or maybe they have multiple ones that they use to film the commercials, so they need it to be fairly standard to everybody's island. They can't have it be very, very different. Um, so if I was going to give this island a rating out of 10... I wouldn't, I wouldn't necessarily say it's overly creative, but I would say maybe like a five or six. It's a very beautiful island. There's nothing wrong with it. It's just that it's not as creative as other people's islands would be. Um, my island's more of a mess than this one, but I do find I've got like nice nooks and crannies here that kind of give my island a bit of character. I have like a fake waterfall that I made in the back and like um, the paths all go in a circle. So it's really easy to find yourself around when you're just like going in a circle like this you tell i love running okay i don't know why i just love running um so we're gonna end the video here thank you for watching so much if you could please subscribe if you haven't already that would be amazing i'm trying to get to 700 subscribers at the moment so i need everyone i can possibly get i also have a twitch channel also called fangirl mal so i'm trying to get to 100 followers at the moment um i'm at about 84 so if you guys could go give me a follow that would be a big help both are completely free to do so there's no reason not to uh it just means you'll see more content from me easier um, and if you want to support me on Twitch financially by giving me a sub, that would be amazing. Or cheering me, just join me for my next stream, which will be Wednesdays and Saturdays at 7.30 UK time. And I'll have another video for you next week on Sunday. So thanks for watching, guys. I hope you have a really great day. And I'll see you next week. Bye-bye.